Hello class, this is Scott Parr, your instructor for this course. The date today is Wednesday, the 2nd of February 2022, and this is a quick tutorial on how to insert an image into your discussion board post. So I know some students are posting without adding images or providing links or even adding them as attachments, and while you can do that, it's much nicer for everyone if we can see those photos inside your post, and this is how we do it. So I'm here in Discussion Board. I'm going to click Reply to make an initial post. And I've got the text here. I can just paste this right in. I place the cursor where I want the image to go. And up in the toolbar, there's an icon that looks like a mountain with a sun, which is your standard uh, picture icon. And clicking on that, we see that we can upload a photo. So I click on Upload and I click in the upload box and I navigate to where I have my photo on my computer and click on that. On my Mac, pressing the space bar is going to open a preview to make sure I've got the right file. I'm not sure if it works that way on a PC or not. And this is the file I want. So I press upload and there's a place here for me to enter some description for what this photo is. So I will just type in Uberti and press submit. This is a very high resolution photo and it's gonna be way too big. So once this photo is finished uploading, I can double click on it and you'll see there's a little tab at the bottom for image options. So I click on that and you see over there on the right, I can change the size and the easiest way to do that is by percentage. So I'm going to click on percentage and I think I want this to be about a quarter of the original size. So I'll type in two five for the percentage, and then click on done. And there, that's a much more reasonable size for that photo. Now I just click on post to forum, and we're done. So that's it. That's all there is to it. That's how to insert an image into your discussion board post. If you have any questions or any difficulties doing this, don't ever hesitate to contact me. Thank you again, and I'm looking forward to reading your discussion board posts.